We went downtown to check out all the stores and what people were like. We saw many different people singing and playing musical instruments, many different foods, and people eating different foods. We also saw many different stores with different styles and shapes. When you think about it, not one person in the United States is the same. We all have something different about us. If that's our looks or our cultures and opinions. The way people melt in the United States differs from others. For example, in the United States, Catholic Spanish-speaking communities might keep their language and other cultural family traditions and won't really engage with the American culture. Culture encompasses religion, food, our clothing, and how we wear it, the way we talk, our music, and many other things. Some think America is like a melting pot, where many different cultures have their own distinct flavors. While downtown, me and Emily decided to ask someone what their opinion about the cultures in America was. This is what they think. Last since January 24th, 1981. America's melting pot origins provide fuel for the independent young nation, and the countless technological and social advancements over the decades. However, current political and social movements towards xenophobia are endangering the fundamental ideals of our country. Religious diversity is a part of America's founding ideal. We could literally look at what George Washington, Thomas Jefferson, James Madison said about religious diversity in the late 18th century, and we would look at those, uh, we would look at those things and cherish them today, right? So Washington's statement that uh, this government will give to bigotry no sanction and persecution no assistance, that we all have a like liberty of conscience, uh, Benjamin Franklin uh, making a donation to the building fund of every religious community in Philadelphia, asking them to all uh, celebrate July 4th together to to mourn him together when he died. This notion of welcoming religious diversity, nurturing interfaith cooperation is literally part of America's founding ideal. I think that's also at the center of America's genius because in a diverse democracy, the way you build up that society is you give diverse identity communities their dignity and with that dignity, those diverse identity communities will contribute to the broader society. 